By the gods, this is a good start. Where did these people set up their tent? If there's nothing around the next bend, I'm turning around. Finally. Hey you, little girl. Giacomo Nauta sent me. I'm here about the riddle. Um, do you speak Goretti? I'm a friend. Giacomo told you I would come. He spoke of the hero of Andergast, a strong, courageous and clever man. Not someone I can slice open from head to foot in the blink of an eye. I am the hero of Andergast. Can you do magic? Heal things with fairy magic? The way the hero healed the dreams of an Andergastrian was magic? It wasn't quite like that, but yes. I can repair things magically. Then prove it. This before me is the flying fortress Kishal Reen. I recreated it from my dreams. But no matter what I do, it keeps tipping over. Use your magic to make it stand up, and I'll let you see my father. Piece of cake. No magic necessary here. Hmm. A small fortress made of sticks. It keeps tipping over. Use your magic to make it stand up, and I'll let you see my father. A small fortress made of sticks. It keeps tipping over. Use your magic to make it stand up. A small fortress made of sticks. Use your magic to make A small fortress. Use your Watch and learn. Learn that you have a big mouth? The fortress isn't broken, it's just badly made. Don't make excuses. Use your magic to make it stand up, and I'll let you see my father. All right, all right, I have my...
first the fortress, then the tent. I'm too clumsy. I just cut myself either. The fortress would fit perfectly in the bottle, but how am I supposed to get it in there? You're supposed to do magic, not just recarve everything. I have my own knife. What are you doing? Don't worry, I just want to try something. May I go in now? Papa, there's someone here claiming to be a hero. Send him in. If you truly are the hero, then you're a bit boring. You remind me more of a stupid, grumpy peasant. I'm a bird catcher, and I no longer care what others think of me. I rescued a fairy, and I freed a kingdom. I don't have to prove anything to anyone. All right, all right, go in. But watch your back, I'm right behind you. Ah, Geron, how nice. Come, sit. Sit! Are you Fahi? Yes, sit down. Did you find this place all right? Yeah, yeah. I was told that you sell a spell that can permanently change a person's form. A person's? Or an animal's? But everything in its time. Tea? All right. Ah, a man of taste. That's good. Andergast is cold, is it not? It's all right. But about that spell... Of course. You understand that permanent physical transformation is a formidable power. It demands a great deal of courage to request such power. I have my reasons. I know. Giacomo told me as much. You know my price. Giacomo said something about a riddle. Correct. You like riddles, Geron, don't you? Of course I like riddles. I wouldn't be here otherwise. Excellent! I knew I could count on you. You'll carry it with you for a while, twist it and turn it in your mind, and perhaps even despair briefly. But when you finally solve it, the reward will be much sweeter. Where did you get this riddle anyway? For more than three moons, my daughter and I have both had the same dream every night. It's even more wondrous that this dream tells a true story, a memory from a time 450 years ago, when our world faced its greatest battle. I will now tell you the beginning of the dream. You don't need to know more. And then, the riddle. If you can solve it, you'll receive the power to restore your beloved. And if not? Garon, you are the hero of Andergast. Of course you'll solve it. So... Are you ready? I'm ready. Good. The dream begins, as I said, 450 years ago, in an ancient vault far beneath my home city of Fazar. The powers of darkness threaten the land, and the great and decisive battle is imminent. When one night, a group of heroes enters the tomb of an ancient mogul mage. Prepare yourselves. I shall open the burial chamber now. Are we all here? All here, for crying out loud. It could have been worse. Sure, we could have lost the mute Farkina too. Or the dainty princess who can't fight. <sighs> Calm yourself, Shabib. You're not the only one whose nerves are frayed. Oh, I'm so sorry. Did the princess have to see a little blood? Did it break her tender heart? Yes. Crack. Now you'll have to endure me without one. Princess Zadja, Alric, 
We must stick together. The legendary mask of Malachar lies within this burial chamber. If we succeed in bringing it to the Holy Army in the Rashtulian Wall, the battle against the demons will be mere child's play. If we succeed, and these walls don't swallow us up first. I'm working as fast as I can. Uh, I can't find the lock. Give me a moment. It has to be here somewhere. Stay away from the Guardians, Princess. Even their detached limbs still have some life in them. I feel a throbbing and they're warm, like a sick heart. I feel it quite clearly. Something in these stones lives and breathes. I feel it quite something in these stones. There are grooves here. Letters? Can you read them? No, they're just grooves, nothing more. Why did the Furkina people cast you out? None of your business. True, your past is your problem alone. All that counts is that you lead us safely through the mountains to the army. I just want my money, and soon. Stay down. What did you call me before? Shabib. That's Tula Media for little boy. Without me, you'd be long dead. Please, no quarrels. She started it. Mage? Princess? Why exactly did you choose us as companions? Who are you talking about in particular? Can that mercenary over there do anything other than hit things and yell? Pfft. That's more than you can do, Poppet. Alric keeps the monsters at bay. He's a good man. Did you specifically look for a princess? No. I sent for a Ptolemyde scholar, but those are hard to find in these bloody days. Only a few are able to defend themselves and not fall victim to the marauding bands currently battling for dominance in Fazar. The streets of Fazar have always been a screaming nightmare. And thus, it's an even greater miracle that you survived there for so long. You're the outcast heiress of a toppled ruler. I would not have bet my ducats on you. Will Rahvan really accompany us to the end? Yes. As soon as we're finished here, he'll lead us through the Rashtulian Wall to the Holy Army. He grew up in those mountains. He knows the way better than any other. You do know the Farkina's an outcast, don't you? Even his own people fear him. We have no other choice. We need him. How did a mage like you come to lead a group such as this? I wanted to join the army in Punin, when a nobleman from Fazar told me about the mask. The rest was a question of money and determination. What was Harun's role? He was your personal bodyguard. He was supposed to protect you. Which he did, right up until the end. I am sorry about him. He knew the risks. The important thing is that you're still alive. Enough of that. What do we do next? We force our way into the burial chamber of the Mughal and steal the Mask of Malachar. Then we take it over the peaks of the Rashtulian Wall to the Holy Army before they march into battle. And there we triumph, or perish miserably. The future of this world is in our hands. How deep are we? Only the gods know. 
Fazar was built up layer by layer on the ruins of older dynasties. Beneath that lay vaults as ancient as the land itself. This burial chamber, for example, was erected 2,000 years ago by the last living Mughal mage, Malakar. It is said he was a grand master of elemental and transformation magic. He could bend ore and earth to his will with the snap of his fingers. These halls were his greatest and last piece of work. Are you sure that the mask waits behind these walls? Yes, quite sure. No one knows where the Mughal Malakar obtained the mask, or if he even created it himself. But he was so obsessed with it and its power that he ultimately took it with him to his grave. It's also said that he never succeeded in awakening its true power while he lived. What does it do? They say that the wearer of the mask can turn any lost battle, indeed any defeat and any loss at all, into an enduring victory. Why is it called the Holy Army? The Holy Army is an army of clerics, only with the holy might of the gods, so it is believed can we withstand the attacking hordes of demons? You said the army is advancing over the Rashtulian mountains. Why such a difficult route? Most of the passes are guarded by the legions of evil. In addition, there's a magical place across the peaks of the Rashtulian wall where they hope to forge a final, crucial alliance. We'll join the army there. How could it come to this? An invasion of evil in our age? There are always dark times, Princess. But what exactly brought them about no longer matters. The only important thing is that we're prepared to fight. The greatest heroes of our age have gathered to fight the decisive battle in the Gorian Desert. And to go down in history forever. If we win. Aren't you starting to get tired of prattling? He's right. We have to continue. Do you have no more questions? What's the problem? The lock is hidden. I can't find it. Some sort of secret mechanism. Perhaps an objectum disparatic. Whatever it may be, you have to open it. Are you sure you don't need help? No. The lock is most certainly hidden by magic. Only I can find it. I'm not touching that. It looks sticky and poisonous. I'm not touching. It looks... It looks like blood. It looks like bl They're watching me. They're watching me. The Guardians are more fragile than they look. I hope that was the last. They're watching me. Now to get the key into the lock, and then the door will be open. Where do you see a lock? The door is covered in filth. What does a princess know about filth? Enough to know that it can be washed off. That's good news for you, isn't it? What are you trying to say? Shh. Silence, please! I need quiet. He's an agile fighter. I don't see a single wound. I've only known him since yesterday, and I already know more about him than he does about me. He knows what this is about, but he's not the strong leader he pretends to be. He's a good warrior, but he doesn't deserve to be told so. A finely worked ornamental arch with swirls and patterns Do you have a death wish? You saw what kind of creatures are running around out there. If this is what the princesses in this country are like, I would hate to see the kings. Don't worry, you won't. The last caliph of Fazar was skinned alive five moons ago. Was he a tyrant? Yes, like every ruler in this city. Besides... What? Did you see the tattoo on her arm? I believe it's the mark of Malachar. 
She's a direct descendant. We brought the great, 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 great granddaughter of an accursed mogul mage monster into his burial chamber. Are you out of your mind? She's a good person. Trust me. And we'll soon need her. I have to get in there and find the weapon, or else it was all for nothing. It was that way when we arrived. Who knows if we would have won otherwise. The mage brought down the mogul's earring in order to break the back of the chief guardian. But Haroon was already beyond help. The image of the mogul mage who ruled thousands of years ago and now lies buried here. He looks like a gigantic dwarf. A large hand, nothing else. The legacy of these hands held me prisoner my whole life. But today, I will finally free myself. Oh, Kasim, you'll regret what you've done to me. It was that way when we were... Who knows if we would have... Can you hear me? I'm sorry about your broken legs. It's very lonesome down here. But one step closer, and we'll break your neck as well. The legacy of these hands help... But today, I... Oh, Kasim, you'll regret what you've done to me. I don't deserve to return, not without the mask. It's said that an ancient being lives in these halls. It has two horse legs and an emerald lance and hunts down every grave robber until the end of his days. If we make it to the battle, that won't be very long. The mage brought down the mogul's earring in order, but Haroon was already beyond help. Even if we have to smash the entire burial chamber, I will triumph. The entrance to the tomb is behind this. He's so big, but we noticed him too late. I can't believe how stupid we were. If only I could pull it down somehow. Another guardian. We couldn't kill him, so we had to hack off his legs. You remind me of the palace guards I once knew. But unlike them, you were against me from the beginning, and didn't stab me in the back later. Thanks. I suppose. It would take too long to get him down. We're running out of time. Skewered by his own torch. What an unworthy death. It's hanging just out of reach. He was a fool, but he had the sense to think of things the rest of us didn't consider. Whatever he has on him could help us.
It would take too long to get him down. We're running. Skewered by his own torch. What an unworthy... It's hanging just out of room. He was a fool, but he had the sense to think of things that... Whatever he has on him could help us. Bastard. He's so big. I can't believe how stupid... Our rope. If only we had noticed the Guardians from the other side. No, oh, Just listen to yourself. How pathetic you are. Harun had to die. We all have to be prepared to die. That's the sacrifice we must make in order to rise above our miserable existence. Harun loved horses more than they loved him. Horses and women. Somehow I liked him anyway. Harun had my father's eyes. Now I know why. A roll of bandages. I can't go back yet. My trials have only just begun. Absolutely not. That's... Absolutely not. That's our only way back. That's our way here, and our way back. Remind me of the palace guards I once. But unlike them, you. Thanks. The remains of the colossal earring. That's what finally broke the creature's back. Let the warrior mouth off as much as he likes. In the end, it was the mage who saved our necks. Stay back. We don't know what else is hidden here. The door is covered with a thick crust of grime. Mage. Princess. Stand aside. Under no circumstances should you touch the door. Fine. Then you'll have to do it. What do you think you're doing? There is no hidden mechanism. The door is just filthy. Brush it off, and you'll find your lock. Hmm? Step back.
The six legs open the six locks. By all twelve gods! This is going so well. Relax. I know you just want to help, but I can manage. We'll have to glue it. Stay back. We don't know what else. Who pairs such a complicated lock with such a fragile key? I'm trying to push the pieces of the beetle so they interlock, but it doesn't work. They won't stay in place. I cannot simply tie the key together. It would not hold. I'd rather not. Harun had my father's eye. Now I know why. It smells of plums. I cannot simply tie the key together. It would not hold. The crust is too dry to be wiped away with that. The crust is too dry to be... I should use the rest of its spare... There must be another solution. I don't much care for random guesswork. It looks like blood. Stay away from the Guardians, Prince. Even their detached limbs still have some life in them. He wouldn't like that. Absolutely not. Something in these stone. No. That can't be cut. I don't need a piece of that. Thank you. But we need something sticky. I cannot simply tie the key together. It would not hold. Better not. I can easily tear the bandage with my hands. A roll of bandages. I can't lose my head now. I'm 
not touching that. It looks sticky and poisonous. I should use the rest of it sparingly. That'll never work. No. That'll never work. He's an agile fighter. I'm so but one step closer. I'm trying to push the pieces of the beetle so they interlock, but it doesn't work. They won't stay in place. Stay back. We don't. Better not. You better stay away from me. Gladly. You better stay. Gladly. Stay away from the Guardians, Prince. Even their detached. He wouldn't like that. He wouldn't like that. Now the blade is sticky. Here, glue the leg with this. It's ready. Do you see the glowing inscription, Ulrich? Ancient Tula Media is a dead language spoken only by a very few, by even fewer, since the spiritual leaders of this city were executed together with their caliph. One must be educated to read this script. Educated, like a child from a noble family. Educated, like the last princess of Fazar. That's the reason we brought you. Now, tell me. What's the answer to the riddle on the chamber? The gods be with me. What? What do you read? I can't tell you. It would change too much. This is why we brought her? I don't understand. Princess? Princess, where are you? By the twelve, it's dark. I'm over here. Ah! Ow! Watch out for the beetle key when you leave. It's lying on the ground along with the door. If it breaks, we'll be locked in here. What's that smell? Alric! Don't come in! There's gas in the air! Shine the torch carefully through the door, but stay outside, and no magic! Astral energy could trigger a trap. Be careful where you set foot, princess. Difficult without light. If you know a way to make light without fire or magic, then tell me. Ow! I cut my hand. The hook is now covered in my blood. I've learned my lesson. Nothing and no one injures me twice. The alcohol isn't strong enough to burn. The alcohol isn't... <laughs> Lamp. 
That should be enough. It's nice and shiny once again. I can't get it open any farther with my hands, and even if I could, the light wouldn't be enough to illuminate the whole chamber. I have to make light some other way. That won't lead to anything. The stick has to burn. The stick has to burn first. The stick should burn well without that. Have you found anything? Yes, I believe so, but I have to see it to be sure. This is as far as the torchlight reaches. There's a small crack in the wall somewhere. I can't get it open any- and even if I could, the I have to make light some other way. It's covered in my blood because I'm too stupid to watch out in the dark. What am I supposed to do with that? What am I supposed to You better stay away from Gladly. You better st Gladly. No. Should I tell them? No. It would change everything. Like a freshly sharpened axe. What am I supposed to do with that? What am I supposed to... What am I supposed... It's empty. It smells spicy and sweet. Haroon had my f now I No. I can't get it open any far- and even if I could, the light wouldn't be enough to illuminate the whole chamber. I have to make light some other way. The bandage is now soaked with blood. I've learned my lesson. A sight I know all too well. I'll put the bloody bandage in the bowl. The stick has to burn first. That's not a way out. It looks like something ate through it. What am I supposed to do with that? What am I supposed to... He's dead. He's dead.
You remind But unlike them, you... Thanks. The stick has to burn. I don't even know where I should start. I don't even know where I... Now that's just uninspired. He's ignoring me. What am I supposed to do with that? The stick has to burn first. Hurry, princess. I... Hurry, princess. Hurry, princess. This is as far as the torchlight reaches. There's a small crack in the... I can't lose my head now. I can't get it open any... And even if I could, the light wouldn't be enough to illuminate the whole... I have to make light some other way. I don't see any connection. By the... Is that it? Yes. Yes, that's it. The Mask of Malachar. With that, we will win the battle against the demons once and for all. Bayal! A guardian! Guard the door! If the beetle key is damaged, we'll be locked in here. <laughs> He's buried beneath the Guardian. I might be able to free him with magic, but not with my bare hands. The flames in his eyes are hot. Of course, there's no gas in the air here. Otherwise, the fire in his eyes would have blown up the Guardian's head a long time ago. The second vision showed smoke rising. I can't ignite the bowl itself. Welcome, sh <gasps> What was that? Who are you? What are you doing in my head? Hello? You must touch me if you want to hear me, Sharizad. Are you a demon? To be honest, Sharizad, I have no idea. I can't remember. All at once, I was here. In the dark, chained fast. 
countless centuries ago. You're lying. Not at all. I've seen the rise and fall of every moat of dust in this chamber. It's only my own story that I don't know. Why do I hear you in my head? That comes from your blood, which you sacrificed to me. I've made a pact with a demon? Uh, forgive me. I should have warned you beforehand. Open that door. You can do that, can't you? I'm afraid not. N no. Then what can you do? I can light the braziers and extinguish them, and I can give orders to the Guardians. Awaken the Guardians and order them to tear down the gate. But then you'll run away and leave me behind. Many millennia will pass before another princess stumbles into the cave. You know who I am? Yes. I heard your talk outside the burial chamber. What would you say to another pact? I'll help you get out of the burial chamber, and you'll take me with you. Princess and court magician, mistress and servant, together we'll conquer the world. Deal. What? Really? Who would be stupid enough to free a frightening creature like me so carelessly? I take what I can get. You frighten me. Light the torches. Let us do that together, Sharizard. Turn your bright eyes upon the darkness and concentrate. As long as you're touching me, you can speak to me, but you can also cast my spell. Behold the glories of my master's final resting place. By my ancestors. You're beautiful. So we have an agreement? Yes, 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 we do. Good. You're stuck. I have been hanging here for a very long time, after all. You'll need to loosen the bracket and pull me toward the sky with a strong jerk. Oh, you remember the sky? The sky, freedom, the sparks and sounds of language. Some things one never forgets. You're still stuck. You'll need to loosen the bracket and pull me toward the sky with a strong jerk. glitters like a dagger in the dark, a sight I know all too well. First I ripped open my hand, then I woke a demon. From now on I'm staying away from that bowl. It contains a piece of bandage covered in my blood. The mage and the mask lie buried underneath. The guardian's limbs have mercilessly crushed him. He's buried beneath the Guardian. I might be able to free him with magic, but not with my bare hands. At one end, the magic staff. At the other, a heavy metal ball. Now what? Where does it go? Now what? That's not a way out. It's much too heavy for me to be able to move it. There's a ring hanging on the pillar. Apparently, the pillar was movable once. They're too big and heavy. My will alone is not enough to move them. The staff created some light for me. I don't trust it as far as I can throw it. Of course, there's no gas in the air here. Otherwise, the fire in his eyes would have blown up the Guardian's head a long time ago. I can no longer find the crack. There was a crack of light here somewhere. Now what? 
Where does it go? At one end, the magic star. The mage and the mask lie buried. It's the staff of a terrible and bloodthirsty tyrant, an instrument of the greatest terror these lands have ever seen, and my last hope of getting out of here alive. Get me out of here, and I'll help you. No, that's not it. Get me out of here, and I'll help you. You're still stuck. You'll need to loosen the bracket and pull me toward the sky with a strong jerk. I don't even know where I should... I don't see any connect... I can't lose my head now. That'll never work. Hey! Help! I'm locked in here! Help! Rahwan! If you're still alive, show yourself! The Fakina doesn't seem to like you much, Princess. He's probably dead. Or he abandoned you. All I see are lurking shadows. For anything else, I need light. First I ripped open my hand, from now on I... Hmm... No. Now what? Where? At one end, the magic staff. At the other, a heavy metal ball. That won't lead to anything. I mustn't lose sight of my... That won't help me get it out of there. That won't help me get it out of there. That won't help me get... That won't help me... Get me out of here, and I'll help you. You're still stuck. You'll need to loosen the bracket and pull me toward the sky with a strong jerk. You're still stuck. You'll need to loosen the... That'll never work. He's beyond help. No, 
That's not it. He's beyond help. That's no longer necessary. That's no longer... He's beyond help. He's beyond help. That'll never work. Hmm. Oh, damn. The fabric is too delicate. It burned away immediately. I have to find another way to make light. That's no longer necessary. I don't see any connection. The bowl is already shiny. It's much too heavy for me to be able to move it. There's a ring hanging on the pillar. Apparently the pillar was movable once. That's not a way out. It looks like something ate through it. Now what? Where does it go? At one end, the magic staff. At the other, a heavy metal ball. Get me out of here, and I'll help you. You're still stuck. You'll need to loosen the bracket and pull me toward the sky with a strong jerk. You're still stuck. You'll need to loosen the bracket. No, that's not it. The incense is burning just... I mustn't lose sight of my goal. The hook's already clean. The mage and the mask lie buried underneath. All I see are lurking shadow. For anything else, I need light. Hey! Help! I'm locked in here! All I see are lurking... For anything else... Oh, damn. The fabric is too delicate. It burned away immediately. I have to find another way to make light. I'd rather not. No, that's not it.
No, this is too heavy. I won't get his body free by hand. Hmm. No. The mage and the mask lie. That won't lead to any. Better not. I can't. No, this is. I won't get his. Now what? Where does it go? That might work. If the ball wouldn't pull the staff into the abyss with it. That might work. If the ball would. Now what? It's much too heavy for me. There's a ring hanging on the pillar. Apparently, the pillar was movable one. There, I freed you. Now what? Now? I finally have legs, and I'm no longer alone. I meant, how do we get out of here? We don't. Nobody can escape these walls. But you said. <laughs> oh, Sharizad. This is the darkest hole the likes of which the world has never known. Here, even nothingness means nothing at all. Not even the promise a piece of wood makes to one who is doomed. But let's be friends nonetheless. We could play with the light, or awaken the guardian, or... Even if you will not, I will abide by our agreement. I'll find a way out of here. And if you help me, I'll take you with me. Sherisad? And stop calling me Butterfly. I'm not a butterfly, and we're not friends. From now on, you'll do what I say. What if I won't? Then I'll toss you into an even deeper hole, where absolutely no one will ever find you again. As you command, mistress. You're too kind, mistress. He's still holding the mask. And Harun's dagger. <sighs> You're still alive? Take the mask away from here. Calm yourself. Gather your strength. Mistress, don't you see? He's as good as dead. Have you no pity? Do you? Where should I take the mask? To Draconia. To the prince. To the prince? What prince? Galved? Are you still there? He lies bleeding on the ground, and you pepper him with questions. You truly have no pity, do you? I do, but pity would not have changed anything. It would have made you more human, says a talking staff. He's beyond help. Will all the Guardians be subject to my will from now on? The Mage's spell tore the Guardian to pieces. He's dead. The Guardian's limbs have mercilessly crushed him. Entertaining, isn't it? I've seen better. Oh, how I envy you. Let there be eternal darkness. <sighs> eternal darkness. You can turn them on again any time. Mistress, I know I'm no poet, but please, leave my flowery language alone.
Let there be light. A grand burial chamber just for you. We'll see about that. Make light. Direct my spell at a magical source of fire, and your wish shall be my command. I don't see one. That's because there aren't any here. Make light. Direct my... I don't see one. Th Make light. Direct my spell... I don't see one. That's because... First I ripped open my hand. From now on I'm staying away from that bowl. Wake him. What should he do, mistress? He's already got it. I don't need a fireball there. I don't need a fireball there. That only works with magic artifacts. If only I could pull it down somehow. That only works with magic artifacts. Wake him. What should he do, mistress? Give up. The wall is too thick. Give up. The wall is too thick. I mustn't lose sight of my goal. The spell doesn't work on that. This was the only stone giant in the hall with a will of his own. So you weren't able to play your little games with him? No, I didn't say that. The spell doesn't work. Better not. Forgive me, but raising the dead exceeds even my abilities. Inconceivable. There are magic fireballs outside the chamber. Oh, Sharizad, your presence opens up new horizons for me. It's just another fireball. You try being chained to a tomb wall for a millennia. You learn to enjoy the small things. Wake him. What should he do, mistress? There's nothing here. And since the attacker stepped on the beetle, the exit is now locked tight. Let there be light! A grand burial chamber just for you. We'll see about that. He's beyond help. 
He's dead too. I hope Rahwan at least escaped. Aren't they cute? With their big eyes? Is it still alive? My dear, it was never alive. Its existence is pure will. Your will. Aren't they cute? Good throw. It looks like blood. It's one of the pieces of the key, but it's lying too far away. I still can't reach it. I can't lose my head now. It's lying right in front of the door. A sweet little worm, isn't it? It serves its purpose. The arm lacks the support to strike hard enough. It's holding on tight. Now what? Staff, make the arm grab the leg and throw it up to me. Do you know how strong these guardians are? It would be crushed as soon as the arm grabs it. Think of something else. With one leg, it might get there, but it's just a simple arm, my dear. Ye can't reach it either. Ye can't reach it either. Do you really want to crush him, Minus? No, he doesn't deserve that. That won't lead to anything. There must be another solution. The staff is just long enough. I'll take that as a compliment. But in its current form, it's totally useless as a scoop. I can't lose my head now. No, that's not it. I can easily tear the bandage with... I mustn't lose sight of my goal. Do you remember its power now? Wait a moment. There was... something. No. No, I'm afraid I've forgotten everything. If you want to wake him, then cast my spell on him. I mustn't lose sight of my goal. Staff, make the arm grab the leg and throw it up to me. Do you know how strong these guardians are? I think of something else. No. That... With one leg, it might get there, but... That'll never work. I don't see any connect. I'll have to use tougher measures to get out of here. I don't even know where I should start.
I can't lose my head now. Hmm. No. The ball is heavy, but I managed. The ball is heavy, but I managed. Hmm. That probably isn't magical enough. That only works with magic artifacts. No, that's... Hmm, that probably isn't magic. Hmm. That pro I don't see any connection. Better not. The staff is just long enough. I'll take that as a compliment. But in its current form, it's totally useless as a scoop. What are you doing? I can't see a thing. I'm wrapping the bandage around your horns. Whatever for? You'll find out eventually. Once was enough. Do I have to tell you how humiliating that was? No, I'm perfectly aware. It wouldn't stay there. The Guardian stomped on it and broke it. All the legs have broken off, except one. It's sticky now. It's too narrow to climb through. I hate this door. It's too narrow to climb through. Another hole has opened. A sweet little worm, isn't it? It serves its purpose. I don't much care for random guesswork. It's too narrow to cl Another hole has opened. It's too narrow to climb. There must be another solution. Another hole has opened. Hmm. That probably isn't magical enough. It's already in the hole. It looks like something ate through it. Yes, that was a major event. It is a pity I was asleep when it happened. It's already in the hole. It looks like something ate through it. Yes, that was a major event. It is a pity I was asleep when it happened. That only works with magic artifacts.
That would be too cruel. Another hole has opened. No. I'd rather not. If I remove it, the lock will close, and my arm will be chopped off like a thief's. I won't find any more beetle legs. Another hole has opened. It's too narrow to climb through. A sweet little worm, isn't it? It serves its purpose. A sweet little worm. It serves its... Forgive me, but raising the dead exceeds... Ye can't reach it either. I don't much care for random guesswork. With one leg, it might get there, but it's just a simple arm, my dear. Another hole has opened. It's too narrow to climb through. I don't even know where I should start. I don't see any con- Wake him. What should he do, mistress? Give up. The wall is give up. I've learned my lesson. It glitters like a dagger in the dark, a sight I know all too well. I can easily tear the... Better not. I don't even... I don't see any connection. Once was enough. Better not. Now that's just uninspired. Ye can't reach it either. Ye can't reach it either. Oh, please leave it on, mistress. I have never seen the world outside my chamber with my own eyes. If you don't want to obey, then just ignore my orders. As you wish. Now you have a source of light, but the door is still closed. Patience. I'm feeling my way forward, even if I don't know where my steps are taking me. Now you have a source of light, but the door is still... Patience. I'm feeling... Even if I don't know where my... Good throw. Oh, please leave it on, mistress. I have never seen the world outside my chamber with my own eyes. Don't worry, my little pillows. Princess Sandia will be a good mistress to you. As if I'll stay here.
As if you'll ever get out. Awaken the pillars. And what, in your opinion, should they do? Wink at you? That would only make me jealous and possessive. I've changed my mind. Let them sleep. I've changed my mind. Let them sleep. Is that black slime in the walls? Or blood? Even after a thousand years of curious observation, I haven't been able to find out. I have lovingly dubbed it phlegm. The walls are full of it. It looks like blood. I mustn't lose sight of my goal. I can't glue it any more than that. I'll have to use tougher measures to get out of here. It's too narrow to climb through. Another hole has opened. I can't lose my head now. The ball is heavy, but I managed. I don't need a piece of... I can't lose my... That'll never work. There's writing on the inside. What must I do to awaken its power? Look deep within yourself. What was the cruelest thing ever done to you? I was betrayed and humiliated. Do you remember the face of the one who did this to you? Yes. Look deep into his eyes and... Shazam! Wherever he may be, he now has the hiccups. I'm tired of your little games. <laughs> it was just a joke. Did I not already tell you that I have no idea what the mask does? I have a vague recollection, but... That's all. I'm going to find out, sooner or later. Hmm. No. Now that's just uninspired. Hmm. No. No. I can easily... That's no longer necessary. The bowl is already shiny. It only works on people. Until I know it, I can easily t Once was enough. I'm always at your service, mistress. Do you remember its power now? Wait a moment. There was something. No, no, I'm afraid I've forgotten everything. I don't even know where I should start. Thanks, mistress, but I'm jittery enough already. It's too narrow to climb through. I need something with a point to enlarge the opening. He wouldn't like that. He wouldn't like that. He wouldn't like that. He wouldn't like that. That's no longer. He wouldn't like that. It's too narrow to climb. It's too narrow. I've changed my mind. Let them sleep. He can't reach it either.
With one leg, it might get there, but it's just a simple arm. I'm too far away. He's beyond help. Do you really want to crush him, Highness? No, he doesn't deserve that. That can't be cut. I can't glue it any more than that. I can't glue... If I remove it, the lock will close, and my arm will be chopped off like a thief's. A sweet little worm, isn't it? It serves its purpose. If I remove it, I'm... I won't find any more beetle legs. It doesn't open. Not without the right key. Or an elephant and a rope. It doesn't open. Not without the right key. Or an elephant and a rope. It's already in the hole. It looks like something ate through it. Yes, that was a major event. It is a pity I was asleep when it happened. It's much too heavy for me to be able to move it. The ball is heavy, but I man I'd rather not. That only works with magic, Artie. Hmm, that probably isn't magical enough. Order the Guardian to pull down the door. Harder. Make him pull harder. He can't. The door is too strong for him. <sighs> if this one can't do it, then another one will have to. I'm too far away. Ah, oh, princess, that won't do any good. I've had eons to try and pull down these walls, and I haven't succeeded. Why should a girl achieve so much more in a short time than I did in a millennia? Even if we have to smash the entire burial chamber, I will triumph. The mage brought down, but Haroon was already be- I'm too far away. First, I have to get out. Hello? Hello? He can't hear me. Awaken! Accept it finally and give up. The Guardians are much too weak. I'm too far away. The Colossus is also a guardian, right? Wake him! Sherizad, are you... are you really sure? I said, wake him! As you wish. Take the guardian... and pull!
<laughs> what was that? I tore open a door through pure force of will. No, you laughed like a young girl. Hey! You? You're still alive? I waited. You could have helped me. You have the mask. Where's my money? Our employer is dead. You'll get your money if you help me get out of here and take me through the mountains to Draconia. <laughs> Wait. Stop. I'll pay you. You? You forget. I'm a princess. What do you have? You will have this silver platter in payment. Silver is not enough. As the daughter of the Caliph, I possess wealth beyond your imagining. The Caliph is dead. The palace plundered. I was there. If you take me safely to our destination, you'll receive my most precious possession. My Almandin. It's worth more than anything else you'll ever hold in your hands. Huh. Good draconia for the ruby. Deal. He'll make a poor servant to you. At least I know what to make of him. May I ask you something else? Because I don't understand you. Why are you doing all this? You're rich. Beautiful. You have power. What else do you want to achieve? I want to go to war. And I need a weapon. But why? To win the battle. To be immortalized in history. A thousand years from now, people will tell tales of my deeds and whisper my name in awe. Sadia al-Kabir, the greatest heroine the world has ever seen. Sadia al-Kabir? Never heard of her. Neither you nor anyone else. The poor girl has been utterly forgotten. How does the story continue? With the help of the Frakina, Sadia took the mask over the Rashtulian Wall to Draconia. She joined the troops there and went to battle. But those are all unimportant details. Don't concern yourself with them. Only one thing matters. The riddle I shall now tell you. The inscription on the burial chamber. How can the rest of the story not be important? Well, it is important, but not for you. Trust me. In this one case, ignorance is truly a blessing. If no one remembers her, how do you know that this woman really existed? I investigated it myself. Malachar's burial chamber really existed. And over 450 years ago, a young woman was seen climbing out of that very tunnel with a fakina and setting out towards the Rashtulian wall. I swear to you, in the name of my father and all my forefathers, Sadia's tale is a true story. Do I understand you correctly? The glowing inscription on the burial chamber, that's the riddle. Quite correct. An archaic inscription written in ancient Talamedia. As an educated Talamede princess, Sadja was the only one who could read it. I created a transcription from my memory, and an old friend translated it for me. It reads as the stone over the scarab. So rules the scarab over the stone. Enter if to you the answer is known. If not, then forever your life I'll own. Eerie. I believe Sadia knew the answer, else she would never have entered the chamber. But why didn't she tell the others? Didn't she send them all to their doom that way? I see you paid attention. I give you three days to solve the riddle. On the fourth day, I'll move on, whether you know the answer or not. And if I solve it by then? You shall have what you want from me. A spell of the mightiest transformation. A spell which transforms any living being into any form you desire. Deal. <laughs> I like you, Geron. I'm certain our business will turn out well for both of us. 
Believe me, I hope so too.